What's up guys, Joey here. I just wanted to share a fix for the Lost Ark technical beta to do with weird uh, graphical blurring that just makes the entire game look like smeared. Like it's just a weird I can't even explain it. It just doesn't look crisp. Um, it doesn't look it doesn't look that good. Like you can just see it around the plants, around the flowers where the mouse is, and just the graphics in general, it's just like it's like there's low quality somewhere, like blurring. And I went through and tried disabling everything, and the main issue seems to be to do with anti-aliasing combined with full screen mode and borderless. So in full screen mode, the anti-aliasing seems to work okay, but the problem with full screen is you can't actually record or share, you know, you can't share recordings to friends. So if you're on AMD in particular, this is where I'm experiencing the issue. And when I go into borderless, this is where the blurring gets really bad. So borderless is what I want to run, but I don't want this weird blur. And I figured out it was an anti-aliasing problem because after disabling everything else, and no, it's not depth of field either because you can't completely disable the depth of field. Uh, this setting just improves the depth of field to make it look a little bit better. But as you can see, turning it off doesn't do anything. And it also says change requires restarting the game for a lot of these settings, but it doesn't. Like if I hit apply and turn off the um, indirect shadows, you can see it's basically uh, ambient occlusion type of effect. But if you just look closely at the character models uh, somewhere on the screen, find one, and if I turn up anti-aliasing, you might, it's really subtle, but you might notice a bit more blur on the character models. I have this little gnome person in the top right. Uh, when I activate anti-aliasing maxed, he actually gets blurrier. And it, it is really subtle, but that's how I figured out the issue. And the fix, at least on AMD for now, is to force anti-aliasing enhancement in the drivers and anisotropic filtering as well as radion image sharpening if you have it, uh, which I think most AMD cards have it available. So I'm just going to show you now, show you the fix and how it looks after the fix because I've taken a screenshot of this um, exact spot in the game. And you can see the center doesn't actually look that bad and if I zoom in it looks perfectly fine. It's just everything else in the background blurs but um, you can't really remove that, that's just an effect built into the game. But for the most part, we can fix this zoomed out blur that a lot of people are complaining about that actually makes the game look bad. So, alrighty. Um, let's exit out now. Open your Radeon software. Go to the gaming tab. Okay, I've got to back out of I've already done it, so I'll just show you the steps to add it. But just go to these three dots in the gaming tab. Add a game. Find your Steam directory that you've installed the game. So for me, it's on my E drive. Go to Steam Library, Steam Apps. So this is in your Steam folder. Steam Library, Steam Apps, Common, Lost Ark Beta Playtest, Binaries, Win64, and it's in here, lostark.exe. So add that, and that'll add an entry into your into your Radeon. And you can see I've got Lost Ark here. Dark here. It's actually got two. Maybe it updated itself. Um, or it's where it saved something. <laughs> but anyway, uh, so in here, Lost Ark, I want to scroll down. They already had an uh, image sharpening on. It wasn't actually helping. Uh, you need to go to Anti-Aliasing and set it to Enhance Application Settings. So that's adding multi-sampling, enhancing the multi-sampling. And then I'm not 100% sure on this one. It helps a little bit, but the main one is this um, Enhance Application Settings. And then you can turn this to 8 or 16, depending on what game re resolution. Like, I'm suffering this issue in ultra-wide, so it might be ultra-wide specific. But if you happen to be getting it at 1440 or 1080p, you can give it a go. Uh, try the anisotropic filtering at times 16 if you're on a lower resolution. Uh, times 8 works fine for me, and nothing else. That's all. It's really just enabling that. Click it again. Okay, it's not working from that one. So it must have been the other entry. Like, it's created two entries for whatever reason. Uh, one of them's Lost Ark technical beta so I'll just have to make sure I've got the fixes enabled here. Uh, this is actually what worked for me the first time. I don't know why it created a second entry. It could just be because the game's in beta. A little bit you know bugs with the driver. I wouldn't worry about that and I wanted image sharpening on. I normally have it around 70% but yeah so you can see the settings I've got here. The aliasing um, and yeah so enhance application settings launch. That's the one that worked. I'll but yeah, just take a look at that note and the flowers now. I haven't changed any settings. Everything just looks crisp. Uh, maybe even over sharpened a tiny bit. 
Like this uh, warrior here looks a little bit over sharpened. Um, but you know, you can play with those settings as well uh, between launches. Oh, um, and you actually want your in-game anti-aliasing on for this fix. It'll it'll actually help a little bit. Um, so it actually you can see the blurring it adds, but it helps with the uh, jaggies from over sharpening. So now nothing doesn't look nothing looks as sharpened as before. And basically, yeah, better depth of field can all of these effects can still be on. The only one that really seems to affect the image quality noticeably is the bloom effect uh, that makes the glow on some characters. It just kind of adds blur almost um, to the way that it works. But yeah, take a look at that. Just look at the crispness, the little gnomey dude. And um, just the floor, the textures, everything is sharper and it makes the game look much, much better. It, it, it's night and day for me. Uh, I can just see the the grass, the everything, the concrete. This, even the wall, the texture on the wall is like so much better, so much sharper on the right side after the fix. But yeah, just take a good look at those character blocks and the blurriness. So fix off on the left, fix on on the right. Wax on, wax off. So yeah, I hope that helps you guys out, and I'll just like go back into the game now, and you can just take a look. If you're having this blurring issue, you can literally just see how much better it looks. Uh, I am playing at 180 ms though, so you know that doesn't help uh, with the movement. But yeah, this game looks so much better uh, with the anti-aliasing enhancement. Uh, my friend didn't have it on his 1080 Ti at the same resolution, but in here it was really blurry before. And yeah, now it looks so much better. But when you zoom in, it's not an issue. Uh, it's more of an issue when you're zoomed out. Alrighty, well thanks for watching guys, and I hope that helps you out.